We are out there fully staffed every day, every shift. We're keeping on top of everything. We've got all kinds of contingency plans. If we start seeing a huge rise in, in illness here in Brown County and Green Bay, we've worked with all the other chiefs from all the other agencies, as well as the sheriff from Brown County. We're hoping for the best, but you know, optimism is not the best strategy. We always want to be ready and be prepared. We have a temperature station when you first walk in at the beginning of your shift. We have people take their temperature to make sure that they don't have a fever that they don't know about. We have a mandatory hand washing station. Whenever you enter the station, you have to wash your hands at our hand washing station. We have not uh, had roll call for several weeks. Our officers go directly to their cars. They get a quick briefing from their watch commander outside, and then they go out in the field and do their work. We started providing all our officers with personal protective equipment, a mask, safety glasses. Obviously, we already have gloves. We are asked the officers to keep that six foot distance and, and when they go to people's houses, we ask them to call the person out into the yard or on the porch. No need to go into a house unless it's a, a true emergency. We're also looking at eliminating some of our specialized units, you know, whether it's school resource officer, community policing, traffic unit. We may have to fold those officers back into patrol if we start losing officers to illness or to quarantine. So we do a lot of things to keep our officers safe because we wanna have those officers available out there so that everybody in the community can be kept safe as well. When it comes to phone calls and letters and people putting stuff out of the station, Green Bay's terrific. They really, really support their cops here in this town. I couldn't be happier and I couldn't be prouder of the work that's getting done out there. We can defeat this virus if we all work together and we can keep Green Bay and Brown County from, from getting much of the virus if we all continue to work together. And Chief Smith adds that no officers on the force have contracted the coronavirus. However, if they do become affected, officers may move to 12-hour shifts to give those impacted more days off to recover.